Welcome to San Diego State University's 2021 Commencement Ceremony for the College of Professional Studies and Fine Arts. Congratulations, graduates. It is important to open this moment with a celebration of place and of the values and history of the space we occupy at San Diego State University. That remains an important practice even when we come together across distance. For millennia, the Kumeyaay people have been part of this land. This land has nourished, healed, protected, and embraced them for many generations in a relationship of balance and harmony. As members of the San Diego State community, we acknowledge this legacy. We promote this balance and harmony. We find inspiration from this land, the land of the Kumeyaay. Yeah, Khan. And now for the singing of the national anthem, please welcome Ms. Victoria Matlock Fowler from SDSU's musical theater program. Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hail at the twilight's last gleaming whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight or the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming and the rocket's red glare the bombs bursting in that our flag was still there. Oh, say does that star-spangled banner yet wave o'er the land of the free? And the Ladies and gentlemen, the Dean for the College of Professional Studies and Fine Arts, Dr. Peggy Shannon. On behalf of the faculty and staff of the College of Professional Studies and Fine Arts, I'm delighted to extend greetings to the families, friends, and guests celebrating this significant event. And to the graduates, congratulations on completing your degree from SDSU. This is a special day for all of us in an academic year that has been unlike any other. The COVID-19 pandemic has required all of you to face unfamiliar challenges, personal losses, and to invent new ways to learn, research, and create. I, along with your family and friends, recognize and celebrate your optimism, resilience, and the perseverance that has brought you to this day. When you started your academic journey at SDSU, none of us could have envisioned we would be celebrating quite like this. But innovation seems to be the word of the year, and nothing will keep us from finding a way to celebrate you. All of us have served as witnesses to your spirit of innovation. You have explored new technologies to reach artists and audiences, used virtual platforms to connect with industry, engaged as social justice change agents, busted disinformation, developed as leaders, and used research and complex data to improve the human condition. Your sophisticated solutions have broken boundaries across every field of study in the college and will change our world for the better. You have proven your ability and you have earned our admiration and our respect. Your achievements have also required support from family and friends who have faith in you, trust you, and who love you. Join me now in thanking them for the encouragement and the sacrifices they have made so that you could earn the degree you will take today. I extend my personal appreciation to each family member represented here for entrusting your loved one 
to SDSU. I know you are as proud of your graduate as we are. Commencement marks the end of an important chapter for our graduates, but it is also a sparkling new beginning as they carry the banner of their degree off into a bright future. Thank you for joining us and sharing this amazing milestone in their academic lives. And now, with a special message for our graduates, please welcome San Diego State University President, Dr. Adela De La Torre. As President of San Diego State University, I can't imagine a greater honor or one that fills me with more pride than to congratulate our extraordinary graduating classes. Your inherent curiosity, compassion, tenacity, and courage helped you reach this important milestone in your life and you achieve success during one of the most challenging periods in recent memory. For many of us, our daily lives were turned upside down, but the positive news is hundreds of millions of people around the world will be vaccinated. In many ways, I expect your last year at college did not go as planned, but as much as this last year will be remembered for its many challenges, this graduating class and your families will be remembered for your incredible resilience for remaining focused and achieving your dreams. You have persisted and succeeded. You have graduated. At the same time, many of you made your powerful voices heard on issues that were important to you. You remained true to your goal to advance your education and earn the degree you worked so hard for. I know you will continue to chase your dreams. You will make your mark. You've proved that time and time again. Graduates, I'm so proud of you and your families. If anyone wants to know what it takes to maintain focus and commitment, just look at our 2020 and 2021 graduating classes. Let me cite just a few quick examples. Milano Siwa and Monica Siwa, two sisters, one a student and one an alumna, started a volunteer group to assist older San Diego residents who speak languages other than English to get their groceries and other essential items. Within just a few days, 40 volunteers speaking Farsi, Spanish, French, Japanese, and other languages were assisting more than 100 San Diegans. More than 300 SDSU nursing students were trained to administer COVID-19 vaccines across San Diego. The students are now at county vaccination sites directly assisting with vaccination and are actively reducing the spread of COVID-19 and contributing to statewide reopening plans. Through a partnership between San Diego County and our public health faculty, SDSU students were trained to help identify people who have come into contact with those diagnosed with COVID-19. These students are doing their part to keep the virus from spreading. And hundreds of SDSU students danced all night during the dance marathon at SDSU, raising more than $372,000 for patients and families at Rady Children's Hospital of San Diego, refusing to give up this important effort even during a pandemic. And our amazing men's basketball team worked tirelessly to practice, compete, and comply under the strictest COVID safety protocols and were victorious in hanging two new banners in Viejas Arena, one as Mountain West Conference champions and another as Mountain West tournament winners. And kudos to Clara Thormalm of the SDSU swimming and diving team for receiving Mountain West Swimmer of the Year two years in a row. Each of these makes us proud as fellow Aztecs. Go Aztecs! There are countless examples of SDSU students stepping up, competing on and off the field with their heart and soul, and helping out to do their parts to put this pandemic behind us. Graduates, you have more than earned your degree in your chosen fields. You will be stronger in the job market and in your future because of your journey this past year. Your legacy will live long here at the university. I hope you will always consider SDSU as your home. You are part of this family and our global network of more than 400,000 living alumni. Please stay connected to the university and to one another, no matter where your dreams and careers may take you. So congratulations again for all you've achieved. I can't wait to see your future accomplishments. We now recognize students graduating with academic honors and those who have committed to military service, followed by the conferral of degrees. Presentations will be made by President Adela De La Torre and Provost Salvador Hector Ochoa. 
It's a particularly special moment when we recognize our undergraduate degree candidates whose academic achievements have earned them Latin honors for outstanding scholarship. To graduate cum laude requires a cumulative grade point average of 3.5 to 3.64. Congratulations to students graduating with honor cum laude. To graduate magna cum laude requires a cumulative grade point average of 3.65 to 3.79. Graduates with the honor of magna cum laude, we congratulate you. And to graduate summa cum laude requires a cumulative grade point average of 3.8 or above. Join me in honoring this year's graduates who've earned the honor of summa cum laude. Congratulations. San Diego State is proud to be a strong supporter of military veterans who have served our country, as well as students pursuing futures in the armed services through their participation in ROTC programs. We would like to formally recognize all graduating ROTC students and graduating students who are or have been members of the armed services Thank you for your commitment and service. We are proud to call you Aztecs. President De La Torre, San Diego State University is pleased to recognize graduates completing their doctoral and terminal degrees. They have fulfilled all the requirements for this degree and are worthy of that distinction. Upon recommendation of the faculty and by virtue of the authority vested in me by the Board of Trustees of the California State University, I hereby confer upon each of you the appropriate doctoral and terminal degree with all the rights, privileges, and responsibilities pertaining thereto. Congratulations. President De La Torre. San Diego State University is pleased to recognize graduates completing the master's degree. They have fulfilled all the requirements for this degree and are worthy of that distinction. Upon recommendation of the faculty and by virtue of the authority vested in me by the Board of Trustees of the California State University, I hereby confer upon each of you the appropriate master's degree with all the rights, privileges, and responsibilities pertaining thereto. Congratulations. President De La Torre, San Diego State University is pleased to recognize graduates completing the bachelor's degree. They have completed all the requirements for this degree and are worthy of that distinction. By virtue of the authority vested in me by the Board of Trustees of the California State University and upon recommendation of the faculty, I confer upon you the bachelor's degree with all the rights, privileges, and responsibilities pertaining thereto. It is with great pleasure that I present this diploma to symbolize the awarding of bachelor's degrees to the graduating classes of 2020 and 2021. Congratulations. And now, please welcome Associated Students President, Mr. Christian Holt. Graduates, I am excited and honored to share this moment with you, and I am thankful for the opportunity to have served as your Associated Students President for the 2020-2021 school year. We have come a long way <laughs> together as students, both graduate and undergraduate. To all the family and friends who have supported and guided us throughout this journey, Thank you. This moment would not be possible without your love and encouragement. Fellow graduates, each of you tuning in today have shown strength and resilience that are unmatched. You've had to overcome many obstacles to make it here. In this moment, let's remember all that San Diego State University has taught us, including the valuable lessons we learned in and outside of the classroom. Our experiences have prepared us to change the world for the better. Before diving into the wonderful things our graduating class has gotten to experience and the challenges that have come along the way, I would first like to introduce you all to the theme that this year's AS Leadership came up with, the concept of one. That all it takes to change someone's life forever is one hello, one conversation, and one action. This year, the concept of one has been more important than ever, given the many extraordinary circumstances that our country has been faced with. We've had the unique opportunity to make an impact on each other's lives 
in a time where many of us have longed for social interaction, academic success, and financial relief. The concept of one is essentially everyday leadership in action. It is truly that one kind gesture that you may have given a stranger or friend that made a life-changing impact on them and led them to pursue something they may have never thought of before. Our student journeys have been filled with exhilarating memories and events, like the annual Aztec Night Carnivals, getting to see our favorite artists in the Greenfest concerts, our football team defeating Stanford in 2017, trying the amazing food at those Thursday farmer's markets, and of course, the winning seasons of our men's basketball team. We've also gotten to experience something new, a mode of programming where all students can tune in no matter where they were in the world. Through these virtual events, it was great seeing Leslie Baker from The Office, Patrice Cullors, the founder of BLM, Tiffany Haddish, Bretman Rock, and more. Although this may be the end of our undergraduate or graduate experience, this is not the ending of our SDSU story. It's the beginning of a new chapter. It is now our time to pay it forward as alumni of San Diego State University. And now, at this time, I would like to ask my fellow bachelor's degree candidates to please join me in marking this important moment. It's time for us to move our tassel. Even if you're not wearing your cap, this is the moment to give a high five and virtual hug to everyone who's celebrating with you right now. At the count of three, let's do this. One, two, three. Now move your tassel from the right side to the left side. Congratulations, everyone, and go Aztecs. <laughs>